Hi, it's April 17th of 2020. Here in San Antonio, we're in the midst of the COVID-19 pandemic. My name is John Pilcher. I'm a bariatric surgeon here in San Antonio. And I've been surprised over the last few weeks of the pandemic how many of my post-op bariatric patients have been reaching out to me and asking what's the effect of bariatric surgery on their immune system. They're concerned in the setting of the pandemic, and I understand that, but the surprise comes from the fact that uh, we in the bariatric surgery community, we know and we assume and we think of it as a given that bariatric surgery is a huge positive for immune function for patients who undergo the operation. Now, it's not that bariatric surgery itself is some kind of superpower against infections and against the pandemic. That's not the case. It's just that the obesity disease itself is so bad for the immune system. Folks who suffer from the obesity disease have many uh, immune system compromises. They have a worse rate of infections, uh, worse impact of infections with mortality rate from kind of common garden variety infections. They have a uh, worse risk of cancer, uh, several different types of cancer and dying from the cancer because the immune system doesn't work correctly to uh, survey or protect against cancer. And, uh, and then very pertinent to this current pandemic, uh, folks with this obesity condition have been shown to have a less effective response to vaccines that have been given. This information I'm giving you was established years ago before anyone was even thinking about the pandemic. Blood testing in folks with the obesity condition shows that the obesity disease disrupts immunity by overacting the inflammatory system. Commonly elevated inflammatory markers include CRP, leptin, interleukin-6, tumor necrosis factor alpha. Macrophages and natural killer cells, which are anti-cancer cells, uh, their activity is also diminished. Uh, the inflammatory system is so overstimulated all the time that it can't respond correctly when uh, actual cancer cells or infection comes along. Patients can actually feel this inflammatory effect on a daily basis with increased fatigue and increased pain. Bariatric surgery has been proven over the years to actually help the immune system return to a stable and effective level of function and to decrease the overall level of inflammation. Once patients get past the early uh, stress phase of the surgery, which is about the first two weeks, the surgery has a hormonal effect to help the system come back into a healthier balance. It's been shown multiple times over the years that these abnormal blood tests that go with inflammation, they return to normal in the first few months after surgery. It's also been shown that cancer risk is dramatically reduced after bariatric surgery, returning the bariatric surgery patients to the normal healthy population baseline. The rate of serious infections drops as well. So if you've already had bariatric surgery, that's awesome. Congratulations, and I think you've taken a tremendous step towards your overall health and even your health as it might apply to this COVID pandemic. On the other hand, if you're still suffering from this obesity condition and you want to make a proactive change to improve your overall health, as well as protect against infections and virus attacks, then um, surgery could be right for you. Now, here in the middle of April, it's not the right time, but uh, the society is opening up over the next few weeks or months, and uh, we are still having online conversations with our patients to help them get the ball rolling for those who are interested.